Hey guys, it's Carlene, and today I have a DIY video for you. So a few months ago, I fell in love with these sandals that cost upwards of $400. That's as much as I've seen them for. And they're called pom-pom sandals. They are so adorable. Today I'm doing my version of a DIY pom-pom sandal. So let's get started. So first you want to start out with your materials of choice. I purchased these pom-poms from Michaels, and then I did some feathers as well. Now you can get really crazy with this. You can do shells, you can do tassels, and I definitely plan on trying to do some more different variations. But today we're just using those things. You can use craft glue or you can even use crazy glue. I did a combination of both of those today. And uh, I was about to throw these sandals out or give them away. And I decided, hey, why not? create pom-pom sandals with these. Um, these sandals have gotten a lot of wear from me, so I decided to just upcycle them. So I start out by spreading my glue along the band of the sandal. I use a generous amount and try to get it as even as possible. Now you can begin to place them from inside out or from outside in. I did a variation of both of those things. And don't forget to give that pom-pom a firm squeeze against the band to secure it. Okay, so once you're done with that step, you can move on to the next step if you're doing T-strap sandals. So I decided to add some feathers to my sandals today. So I'm applying the glue to the band and then pressing the feathers onto the band. And on the second time around, I applied the glue to the feather and added the second feather. You can add as many feathers as you like. You can really get creative with this, but I just did two feathers. And then I'm going to add some pom-poms on top, as you'll see. And what I did was I applied the glue directly to the pom-poms, and then I firmly pressed them onto the band. And there you have it, my DIY pom-pom sandals. Super easy and super affordable. I didn't spend more than six or seven dollars on the materials and I already had the sandals. So before you throw out your next pair of sandals, think about upcycling them uh, and maybe create these DIY pom-pom sandals. They're super easy. If you enjoyed this video and you wanna see more DIY videos, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss my next upload. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.